I was alright. I thought it was kind of a slow scrimmage, kind of. Uh, no, I don't think we started getting some tempo for that last drive, so that was kind of disappointing. But I thought overall we did you know, a nice job, you know, with the team making the action. So I thought uh, when we did our job, we were productive. When we didn't, we were stalled. Gabe has commented that the secondary is a lot better and that Bush is feeling pressure. Do you feel the same way? Yeah, I think our defense overall, I mean, secondary, linebackers, team line, I think they're, they're really all improved and they're really playing at a high level. So it's making us better, it's making it more competitive, it's making the, our team feel a little better. Speaking of Gabe, how excited were you to have him on your squad today? And what yeah. You about what he did? Well, shoot, I didn't know what team I was on until like literally five seconds before. They're like, Luke, you're on. So that was a, that was a nice surprise. Uh, I don't think Gabe and I have ever played on the same screen team, so it's uh, it's pretty fun throwing at him. I mean, how many times have I targeted him? Uh, Gabe, you have ended uh, felt pretty natural when you got the ball with a uh, minute 48 left in the half to. Uh... Yeah, I just said, you know, I wish that uh, it was a more crunch situation, I guess, but yeah. we still treated it that way, and I thought the guys did a nice job executing. Uh, you know, we just got down there. I think we scored like five seconds left. So that was, that was pretty fun. Those are the those are the fun times playing football. Is it hard not to uh, turn around and watch pretty quickly when you hand it off to James? Sometimes. <laughs> yeah. Well, all three of those guys right now. I mean, I tripped up Gerard because I just wanted to watch him so bad. I am right here, and it's like the second play of the game. So I mean, that was that was my bet on that. But you know, really, all three of the backs are awesome. It seems like the uh, the defensive speed, you, you guys just couldn't get much going with the screen game for those quick hits to the flats today. Yeah, I mean, uh, you know, they're not blitzing or anything like that, so it's kind of like vanilla defense and stuff. So, I mean, we, we just, uh, you know, we just took what they gave us. I mean, screen game wasn't part of it today, and it'll be in the future when they start throwing more stuff at us. But I thought we did, you know, all right for the circumstances we were dealt with. Luke, looking back on the, the spring game two years ago, does that now kind of seem like a springboard for you in terms of your mental game? I uh, yeah, I think that's kind of when people like you know probably started noticing me a little bit. I think uh, you know I always felt like I could play, but I feel like that's when people uh, you know realize that maybe I maybe I can do this and, and stuff like that. So I think it was more uh, support from the outside. I think I've always had a good support support system before that game and, and after. But yeah, I, I kind of look at it as a springboard game for me. Just your thoughts on the spring in general? Do you feel like you guys made the strides you needed to make with the amount of time you had to do it? Yeah, I thought we, uh, you know, made the most of our time. We still got one more practice, so I thought it was a very productive spring from the offensive side, and you know, even competing against the defense, I think they made great strides. So it was a real good team spring for us. Was there a feeling around the team that? Hey, you know, this this could be a really special year if we, if we work hard at every second. I mean, is there a different feeling this year than last year, maybe? I think we still have the same feeling because last year was a different team. You know, we, we kind of changed the momentum around at Washington State, so we kind of had that edge. And, you know, I think we brought that same thing here. And we, we realized what got us to that point last year. We just needed to continue to do those things and step up some outcome. You guys talked last year about how, you know, that success was built in the offseason and the spring. Like, are you taking it upon yourself to still support? Yeah, I mean, it's just to me the same thing as last year, you know, uh, what what made us successful last year, I think, was the tight locker room and, you know, doing all the necessary things in the off season. and we're going to do those same things again, and, you know, it's not even like a hassle, I mean, we love hanging out with each other, we love just spending time with each other outside of football, and uh, we're going to continue to do the same thing. Thanks for your time, Luke.